Hey everyone, this is Jordan from SleekLens.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to do the dreamy portrait effect in Adobe Lightroom. So I'm sure you've seen this effect, it's a very dreamy feel, it's like a soft focus feel, uh, but the portrait or the person in the, the, the photo is actually in very sharp focus. And so it's a, it's a very cool effect, it's a very neat effect, especially if you have something like a wedding that you want to try to apply effect to just to add a little more interest to the photos. And so I'm going to do this effect in only four simple steps and they are very, very easy to follow along with. So go ahead and follow along with me right here. The first step I'm going to do is mess with the, the tone curve. So I'm going to click on the tone curve and this is going to vary between photos, but normally all, all the photos will react the same way. And so you can see I have this little node right here and all I'm going to do is click and drag that up. And you can see it's messing with the photo. It's adding a little more fade into the photo. And I'm just going to drag it up to where, where I think it looks nice. Usually it's right around here, around 10, 11% or so. Uh, you can kind of see that in the uh, top of the graph right there. And so that was my first step. Next step is to take the clarity down. That's the one that kind of really gives the effect. So I'm going to take the clarity and I'm just going to bump that down. You can see if I go down all the way, it's going to give a really washed out kind of blurry effect. Uh, but I'm just going to back it down just a little bit. Right around there is probably probably well. So the next effect I'm going to do is actually sharpen the image. This is this is something that not a lot of people think about, but uh, especially if you ha apply a, a negative clarity effect when we're reducing the midtones. Uh, you really want to apply some sharpening, uh, so I'm just going to apply that just to where it looks right about right. I'm just going to put around 85-ish, somewhere around there, and uh, you can see it's still, it's still got the sharp edges here, which is kind of what we're going for. So the last thing I'm going to do is apply one of the presets, that is the Sleek Lens presets, that is in the uh, Forever Thine Wedding uh, Workflow presets, and I'm going to go down here all the way to number six, and that's the vignette section. And there's a couple vignettes that you can use here. I'm actually going to choose the Black Heavy. And when I click on that, what it does is just darken the edges here and uh, and kind of make sure that your eye goes in there. But what it also does, not only does it darken it, but it actually adds a little more color back after we took away a little bit of uh, color with a fade. And so it really works out pretty well. So that is a very simple four-step dreamy effect in Adobe Lightroom. It's very easy to do. So let's look at the before and after here. You see we got a, it's a nice portrait, but you got this one right here. And what the, what it does is it smooths out the skin. It gives a little more artistic interest to the photo without being very uh, cliche and obnoxious. So I hope you guys enjoyed that quick little tutorial in Adobe Lightroom. Head on over to sleeklens.com for more uh, Photoshop actions, Lightroom presets, all that fun stuff. This has been Jordan from sleeklens.com, and I'll see you in the next video.